How is it going, YouTube? Malikin here. We are going to be talking about, you know, how it has been the past couple days. It's been about like five full days now that Classic is out, I think. Um, the queues are getting a little bit better, and at the same time, I'm capable of like logging very early in the morning. I should probably change the scene so for this. Um, <laughs> hope I didn't trigger anyone for like showing your lines logo there. That's like the transition for my stream. So we're going to be having like a little bit of a chill talk. What is like basically going on, uh, you know, the past couple of days, what level I am and how I am enjoying classics so far. A couple of things that I can tell you is that like about the queue. Um, I've been on the lucky, luckier side of things for the most part, to be honest with you, simply because like uh, I was able to like log in quite early in the morning and then there's always somebody around uh if i have to like take you know like a let's say 30 minutes to like one hour break uh to like keep me some sort of like idle in the game because otherwise when you dc there's about like six hours or so queue uh during the midday and the evening as well and then later on like right now it's like basically midnight it just came midnight and um as you can see it was about like uh <laughs> couldn't sleep bargains no it's just <laughs> <laughs> so um yeah the queue the queue didn't necessarily become a problem for me the past couple of days as i was saying but at the same time um it still is there i feel like it's not as big as before at the very least because people you know are kind of finding like some workarounds obviously uh but the worst thing is is for the people that are you know working the entire day and then coming home and then Unfortunately, logging in like almost at evening, something like 7 p.m. It takes its toll and uh, yeah, we'll definitely su suggest to those people to like either play on a new server or um, I'm not necessarily sure. It's it's I, I, all I want to say is like I can I kind of feel for them. Uh, that is like very, very unfortunate in my opinion. And that's like still, as I said on the er earlier videos of mine, it's in my opinion like the worst part of classic right now, the queue that is. Um, other than that, how the classic has been treating me, warrior leveling, oh my god, it's so challenging. One thing that I can tell you is that as you know, like I have been, you know, streaming for a really long time, I stream every single day over Twitch, and uh, for the most part I really enjoy doing content that is over stream especially, that is kind of struggle-ish, if you know what I mean, like my theme is usually the struggle, okay, the struggle is real, pain and suffering, <laughs> those stuff I really enjoy, and uh, Oh my god, Warrior and Classic, I forgot about this. Especially if you're alone, if you don't have like a party, if you don't have like, you know, some people to like back you up. If you're alone and like you're trying to go through a quest that is like one level ahead of you or something, the struggle is real. Like things can go out of control incredibly fast and it is ridiculous actually. So uh, I've been enjoying it quite a bit. Uh, when I compare my level to the other people that I see around, especially like streamers, YouTubers, or like my friends on my friends list, some of them even, um, I'm a little bit low compared to them for the amount of time that I have actually sank in. But that's, in my opinion, a good thing, as you know, like there's not that much content available at the late game right now, not even Battlegrounds, and I really enjoy doing Battlegrounds, in, especially in Vanilla level, and um, especially with Warrior as well. And, at the same time, another reason is that, like, my community that I have formed right now, this is, like, kind of staying strong. We're not necessarily leveling up all that fast. So these players are going to be, you know, the players that hopefully I'm going to end up playing with together. I'm really, really looking forward to it. And, um, you know, I don't necessarily have a reason to, like, rush for it, let's say. Because they're kind of about the same level. Like, maximum level is, I think, it's either me or, or some other dude. And the rest is, like, kind of following in a slow pace, and I'm kind of okay with this. About the community, um, straight up, like, one thing in my mind is that I want, I want, like, lots of active people, incredibly friendly, helpful, and respectful, especially inside the community, but also towards the server community as well. And I want to achieve this. 
that is the first step and then afterwards being capable of like you know overcoming the content whichever that you would like to anyone so the guild alone is not going to be focusing on like either pvp or pvp but there's going to be like groups inside and there are going to be like officers for basically you know leading pve teams and organizing and same for like pvp as well but that is on the second page the first page as i said is like the forming the community and and being really respectable um respectful and 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 friendly and you know helpful etc and and very active that is very important as well uh, almost like a, almost every day activity sort of uh, that is what i'm trying to form right now obviously it is like very beginning and i'm guessing we're going to be losing a lot of members and we're going to be gaining a lot of members here and there but i think it's going to be a plus and in my opinion this is going to be the hardest progression for me personally uh in classic i feel like the guild you know incandescent trying to like you know thrive with it and trying to achieve that first goal and then afterwards maybe even manage to you know form some sort of like teams that is going on to to organize events for the people that are at the very least uh at the maximum level uh that is going to be like the second part and i think overall this is going to be the hardest uh targets and hardest progression for me and i hope i can like pull it off um Apart from that, I do believe like I'm going to be getting there. As I said, like I don't necessarily mind the slow pace leveling that I've been going through, because I think it is better for the content. And I, this only comes once. I don't think this is going to happen ever again. I'm trying to enjoy it. Like I, I've actually like managed to complete this quest. If you're familiar with the uh, warrior, this axe took me a while to complete because I did it alone and I started doing it around like level 33 I believe and then I realized one of the steps is incredibly hard because it was like level 39 elementals. Elementals are like immune to bleed and I'm playing arms I have two sources of bleed and they are immune to it. And then on top of that like I'm missing getting parried because like they are 3-4 levels above me. It was a nightmare, it was so much pain and suffering, it was great on stream <laughs> and I have died countless times I can tell you. But yeah, at the end, like I managed to complete it and the axe is performing really good and I'm doing a lot of things like this, you know, the struggle here, PvP with the horde over there, getting ganked all the time and stuff, uh, but very much enjoying it and, and trying to... One thing that I can tell you is that like it's been a very long time that I felt like I, I had uh, this attached to the character, you know, I think the last time was World of Warcraft also. So this time it is managing to pull that off too, you know, I really like my character, how he plays, how he moves, how he, how he basically, the animations and stuff, you know, I don't know, I'm not necessarily embarrassed of saying this at all, like I enjoy uh, playing with this dude that you see on the screen and, and that is a very interesting feeling uh, that is um, kind of forming some sort of like a I don't necessarily know attachment so that like I continue playing I, no matter what I am doing so uh, it doesn't necessarily bore me at all so what I can tell is that like in the world of Warcraft I'm doing like a quest of like killing let's say boars you know like 10 boars let's say you know that's not necessarily a fun thing to do in comparison to maybe you know two versus two some sort of like a world pvp let's say and maybe even like you're the upper hand you know that would be a little bit more fun right so my example was that like even the boars are not necessarily boring me because i end up i ended up you know enjoying playing this dude and it's so so interesting actually that is i think thanks to that's like i'm going to be able to sing quite a lot of hours in the upcoming months so there are going to be uh, a lot of videos coming your way especially about like leveling about warrior and a lot of chill videos like the one that that you just watched as well i really hope you enjoyed it I'm going to be seeing you next time guys peace out have a good night